Okay, one minute. One minute? A whole minute? Okay, fine. Two minutes. Oh, come on, sweet. We have okay, a show to do. Let's do right, this. Come all on. right. Thank you very much. All right, you're right. It's time to start the story. No more stalling back. Say, once upon a Wait. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. Uh, sweet, sweet, sweet. Remember, uh, we haven't done our introduction yet. Oh, you're right once again, Bagsy. I am. Why don't I we am. do our little introduction? I thought you'd never ask on okay. me. Ready? <clears throat> oh, Bagsy and Sweeps back again once more. With both of us here, who knows what's in store? A traveling duo tell tales that are grand. With characters that feel. And jokes that land. Oh yeah, Bagsy and Sweeps, sweeps telling tales with heart. Now, now the, the intros, intros are done, we, we can finally start it. Huzzah! What? Start, start it. it. We'll talk about this later. Oh, now, now that we've got that out of the way, we need everyone to help us with something. So focus up here. Eyes, eyes, everybody. Can you help us tell the story here today? Yeah! Oh, thank goodness. We can do our job. Now, we're going to need your help. You are all going to be playing the townspeople in our story. The townspeople are the people who live in the town. You're, you're going to be saying a few things throughout the story. You might be saying some magic words or maybe even scream. Ah! Not you, the kids. It's real. But do you think you can help us with that? Yeah! Oh, thank goodness. Thank you very much. Well, oh, I think we're ready. Let's okay. do it. Okay, now remember, it helps to have as many people as possible say once upon a brick. Let's all say it on three, okay? Ready? On three. One, a two, woo, a three. Once, once upon, upon a brick. brick. Once upon a bit, in this very kingdom, quite some time ago, lived townsfolk who longed for snow. Sure, they had it all, a wonderful king, a thriving land, a third great thing, but what they wanted more than anything was snow, for they had never seen snow in their lifetime. <laughs> and they begged and pleaded with the king, but the king did not know how to bring snow to Castle Hill, so he called upon everyone in his power, including the most powerful wizard in the land! Oh. Let's give it up for the wizard! He was hard at work in his tower with his helpful assistant, Shimbles. Always there. Yes. During that time, the townspeople gathered below the tower to see what the wizard would do next. Quickly, Shimbles! The king has tasked us with something incredibly important. Oh, okay. I'm just saying hi to all the townsfolk. They're waiting below the tower. Come take a look. They are? Uh huh. Let me see. Oh! Hello, dear townsfolk. Is everyone ready for a magical day? Yeah! Yes, the wizard worked tirelessly, attempt after attempt, spell after spell, but to no avail. Uh, av 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 he couldn't do it. Oh, how the townspeople wanted snow. The one thing the king could not give them, for it is impossible to control the weather. Or is it? Huh? Oh, nothing. I just thought I heard narration or something. Shibbles, uh, find me that vial of crushed candy canes and retrieve me one scoop of ice cream from the Yeti shop and finally a uh, one of those beautiful snowflakes over there. Oh, sure thing, Wizzy. Stop calling me that. Oh, my apologies, Sir Wizzy. Uh, say, what is all this for? Well, my young assistant, if you must know, I am creating a spell to finally make it snow here in Castle Hill! Whoa! You can do that? Well, only one way to find out. Quickly, shake the crushed candy canes into the cauldron. Good. Uh, now the ice cream. Oh, and don't forget the snowflake! Good! Now we must say the magic word as loud as possible. I guess this is where you can help us, dear friends. Can we all say the magic word as loud as possible? Okay, follow-up question. Does anyone know what the magic words are? Yeah, what was that magic word again? In case you forgot, Shimbles, Wizzy the magic wazoo. word is Wizzy Wazoo. Oh. Let's see. We shall say it on three. One, two, three. Wizzy Wazoo. What is this? A failed spell! That's what it is! Ah, yes, a failed spell. The wizard felt defeated, but fear not. This is when the townspeople came to his aid. Now we're gonna need your help. On the count of three, let's all say, you can do it to the wizard on three. Ready? One, two, three. You can do it! You hear that, sir? The townsfolk are saying something! All right, this more, we're feeling this time, everybody. From the, from the heart. Okay, on the count of three. One, two, three. Three. 
You're right. I can do it. Thank you, townsfolk. Jimbo's take your breath. I've got this. The wizard worked day and night to do everything he could to create a spell that would finally make it snow. Better ingredients, better spells, better jokes. He did everything he could. When one night, he believed he made a breakthrough. I believe I've made a breakthrough. This could be it. Now all I need is one more ingredient, but it doesn't seem like I have the correct one. Fear not, townsfolk. I will have Shimbles retrieve the correct ingredient tomorrow. First I shall... I, I, I shall... Take a small nap. Oh, now, now it's important that nobody tamper with this spell. Uh, but if anyone sees anything, uh, make sure to, to, to wake me up. The wizard had done well in creating the snowy spell, but this wouldn't be the epic tale it was without introducing the epic evil wizard. Everyone say boo! Hey, I haven't even started yet. Ah, yes. The old wizard's arch nemesis out to destroy what he had created. They have been enemies for what feels like forever. Oh, oh, if he goes near that cauldron, make sure you wake the wizard. to see how this plays out. Let's listen to what the evil wizard has to say. Ah ha ha ha, listen to what I, the evil wizard, has to say. Oh, you silly wizard. You thought you could make it a snow that easily, huh? Well, I don't think snow. Uh. Thanks. Because with this anti-snow formula, no one will be getting snow. And I can finally get to my revenge. A drippity drop into the pot. Ah ha 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 ha. Uh. Explosion! <laughs> oh no! The evil wizard is tampered with the spell! Okay everyone, we can't let our wizard finish that spell! Who knows what would happen? So, make sure we let Wizzy- oh, sorry, Sir Wizzy know not to finish that spell! Ah, what a wonderful nap! Now time to finish my snowy spell! No, 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 no! What do you mean, no? Why can't I finish the spell? What, quick, tell him why you can't finish the spell, quick! Tell him, tell him! Uh-huh, uh-huh. Wait, 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 wait. You're telling me that my arch nemesis came in and tampered with the spell and despite all efforts in trying to awake me from my slumber, I did not wake in time and they slipped out into the night? Yes! What remarkable comprehension! Oh, goodness. Well, thank you for the warning. I will not touch this culture. Eee, Sir Wizzy! I got that ingredient you needed just in the nick of time. Do you mind if I do the honors? Oh, good old Shimbles completely aware of the situation. Here I go! Wait! Shimbles, no! No! <laughs> Sir Wizzy! Get down! Get down! No! Oh, my Ferrari! <laughs> now available at the big shop. <laughs> what just happened? I'm not sure. We best go find out. <laughs> the wizard had never seen anything like this. The spell did quite the opposite of what was originally intended. Oh, the spell brought the sun out to it and it made the land even hotter than it was before. It brought a historic heat wave to Castle Hill. Oh, the days began to grow long and it seemed like there was no hope in sight until... There must be some sort of spell that can reverse this heat wave. Isn't there something in these books that can change it? Oh, let's see. A bagsy and sweeps and the prisoners of Legoland. Uh, Fifty shades of sweeps. Uh, oh, here we go. Oh, how to reverse an evil wizard spell that caused a heat wave and make it snow like you originally planned? That might be it, but I'm much too warm to even begin to read these books. And where is that music coming from? Oh, sorry! 
there might, uh, maybe some of the townsfolk can read some of these pages. I'll be right back. Shimbles made his way down the wizard's tower, down the long spiral staircase. What? Shimbles made his way down the wizard's tower, down the long spiral staircase. All right. Even longer than that. Okay. So many more stairs than that. Just gotta keep on going. Keep okay, going. how long is this gonna keep It's going? called padding out the run time of the show. It's just like that wicked movie. Okay, okay. moving on! <laughs> Shimbles made his way to the bottom of the tower just to realize he'd forgotten the book of ingredients at the top of the tower. Shimbles made his way back up the long spiral staircase, but through this this being a 15 minute show, we're gonna skip that part. Okay. Shimbles made his way to the top of the tower, retrieved the book of ingredients, said hi to Wizzy. Hi, Wizzy. Looked back down at the large, treacherous staircase and decided to take the elevator. everyone, I need some help to save Castle Hill. Isn't there someone in this audience that can read these ingredients? You think you can do it? You're up for it? Okay, here we go. One Christmas wreath, yes. Good job. Mistletoe. Uh-huh. Anti-anti-snow formula. Let's give her a big round of applause. Hey, that's it, we have them. Now I must get back to the wizard. Actually, I think I'll just call to him from down here. Hey, Sir Wizzy! Shimbles, is that you? Where did you go? We figured it out. We have the ingredients. Well, what are you waiting for? Come on up here. Well, I just... All right. Oh. Oh, yeah. Now, for those ingredients first. We have the mistletoe. Oh, and here we have the Christmas tree. Ah ha 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 ha! Ah ha ha! You ho! And not so fast. It's a me, the evil wizard. And you. Hey, how'd you get up there? And what do you mean, how did I get up here? Well, how'd you get up there? I didn't see you go through the tower. How are you at the top? Okay, is that really necessary right now? No, no, I'm on Chimble's side. That's quite confusing. Okay, we're changing the subject. Quiet! I cannot let you finish that spell and make it snow here. Why is it your life's mission to destroy my work? What do you want? Uh, well, if you must know... My violin! First when I was a child... Oh boy. All right, while well, the evil wizard is distracted! And there was a whole Lamborghini in my house! We need to figure out how to stop him! We need to come up with a powerful spell so we can freeze him and then reverse the snow spell! And who put that dog in my bathtub? Shoe dog! Shoe. All right, everyone put your hands up and point them at the wizard! And don't even get me started on that Mr. Gold! And when I say three, I want you to say freeze, okay? One, a two... And then I had a dream I was in a parade all summer, and what are you doing? Three. Oh! I'm a stuck. Hey, wait. Hey, I cannot move my big muscles. Wait a minute. Did you freeze me as some sort of a cruel joke? Because, uh, ha ha ha. Hey, yup. Now okay. there's only one thing left to do. We must reverse the snow spell. So we'll start with the mistletoe, and then the Christmas wreath, and the anti-anti snow formula. And finally, the magic words to make it snow. First, everyone stand. Now, raise your hands once more. Good. Now on three, you all must say the magic words, Wizzy Wazoo. One, two, three. Wizzy Wazoo! You did it, everyone. You made it snow. Give yourselves a big round of applause! Where are they going? Maybe the real snow was the friendships we made along the way. What? No! Look, it's snowing! My, oh my! You've done it! Thank you for all your help, everyone! Now, as for my nemesis, should we unfreeze them? No! Alright, everyone. One more magic spell. Everyone raise their hands and yell, Unfreeze! Unfreeze! Oh. 
my muscles, they all better. Hey, oh no, you made it snow. You made it snow right into my dressing room. Oh, I can have it snow there. You haven't seen the last of me. I will return in once upon a brick three. Two brick, two fury. Hey, wait, why don't you come down here and enjoy the snow with us? Wait, you mean I can play in the snow with you? As long as you don't cause a historic heat wave in Castle Hill again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, silly oh, other oh, wizard. Uh, and so, snow finally came to Castle Hill. The next few months were filled with snowy splendor and thriving times for the kingdom. The evil wizard apologized. I apologize. He apologized to the townsfolk and became good friends with the true wizard of Castle Hill. Both combined their magical talents to make Castle Hill one of the best kingdoms to live in. Oh, and the king was so incredibly pleased with the snow that he officially renamed this realm Snow Kingdom. The two wizards, Shimbles, and the town Spoke, all live. Wait, can we all say it together? <laughs> I love this part. A sure thing, Sir Wiz. All right, when I say and they all lived, I want you all to say happily ever after. Are you ready? Yeah! Okay, and they all lived happily yeah! ever after. Thank you all for joining us for Once Upon a Brickman. We hope you have a wonderful rest of your day here at Legoland, California. Bye-bye, everyone!